Our second um, community live stream for Far Cry 5. Okay. I'm Laureline, community developer, and I will be your host today. Um, here we are in a reproduction of uh, the Marie Mays Spread Eagle Bar, you can see, it's really beautiful. 
Uh, you might also recognize some familiar faces from our previous stream. We have Phil Fournier, our associate producer. Hello, everyone. Our very own uh, Mathias, community lead community developer. Hi, community. <laughs> and uh, Alex, who will uh, be our player today, he's a dev tester. What is exactly a dev tester? A dev tester tests the features before they made their way to the game. Cool, thank you. He did not rehearse that line <laughs> at all. <laughs> um, so, um, yeah, tell me, I will tell you a little bit more about what we're going to see in the stream today. Uh, we'll be mainly focused on, um, on gameplay. Uh, bear in mind that it's, um, it's a work in progress build, so it's uh, not fully polished yet. Um, we will also have a couple of raffles. By the end, uh, we have some, uh, some figurines to, to show you. you. We received the two collector's edition last week, and we could not wait to show it to you during the live stream. Uh, we will also uh, announce the, the winners of the Map Jam uh, 3 on the winter theme, so stay tuned uh, till the end to know more about that. Um, we also have uh, our moderation crew uh, that will uh, take care of uh, your yeah, right questions uh, <laughs> <laughs> on, the, on, the, on the chat on Twitch. We also have UB Gabe with us here in the live stream room, Ooh. so we're super happy about that. Um, yeah, and uh, so maybe we can uh, already jump in the gameplay. Uh, Phil, can you tell us a bit more about what we're going to see today? Uh, why we choose, uh, why you choose actually this, sure. uh, this gameplay? Yeah, uh, so today we're going to be walking through or flying through or driving through uh, <laughs> the Holland Valley, which is basically one region out of three regions that we have in the game. Um, in Hope County, uh, there's, you know, it's, it's representing uh, Mon Montana. So it's a fictional county in Montana. And we're going to be flying around and just exploring that county for ourselves. Mm. Um, you know, with the, the cult kind of taking over that space, uh, we're in John Seed's territory, who's basically one of the brothers of Joseph Seed, the cult leader, the father. Um, so we're going to go fly around, try and see what's going on, help some folks, um, maybe do some hunting, fishing, I don't know, whatever, whatever the game throws at us, we're going to yep. see. Uh, just a reminder, it's live, it's playing on PS4. Yeah, um, maybe Alex, you can show the controller. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I don't know if you've seen it, but yeah. Yeah, yeah he um, So we're going to go around. We're going to try some stuff. Uh, obviously, it's a systemic game, so yeah. it's unscripted. We don't know what's going to happen, but that's what's fun about it. That's so, the beauty of it. Yeah, exactly. So we'll see what Alex comes up with. Um, he, he usually is pretty good at playing okay. the game. So Thanks, Phil. <laughs> what is this fog that he's aiming at? So the, where we see that is, uh, is John C's ranch, I think. So okay. we're going to yeah, approach John C's ranch. Um, we're gonna see. Maybe it's. It seems like it's maybe occupied, or at least there's some defenses. <laughs> let's Alex let's check by firing a round or two. Why not? Yeah. Let's just yeah yeah. Wake them up a little bit. If yeah. they were sleeping, they're probably not sleeping anymore. Yeah. <laughs> because you could have approached it stealthy. Oh yeah. As well. Yeah. There's a lot of ways to approach any situation in Far Cry. Like any tools at your disposal, you can really try and create. You know your own way of approaching or dealing with a situation. So we see, oh, OK. <laughs> Let's just Why not? leave this plane. Parachuting. So this is another maybe less conventional mm -hmm. uh, approach to taking a uh, you know, location. But Alex seems to be comfortable in the air. Nice. That was a nice kill. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, you can really approach any location Ooh. in any way you want. Yeah. Um, uh, you can be solo, you can play with co-op, you can play with uh, uh, guns for hire. Mm. Um, so there's a lot of ways to, to deal with the, the project at Eden's Gate. Yes. And obviously we hear the alarm, that's because you've got, sp like Alex got spotted. Well, obviously, I mean, yeah. he flew in with a plane. <laughs> I don't know. Doing a straight front. Maybe so. it's... <laughs> <laughs> for sure, but yeah, yeah, you could definitely enter in a in more of a stealthy way, yeah. uh, depending also on your, your play style or uh, your weapons. Uh, right now, we see Alex has uh, equipped a, a, an assault rifle yeah, yeah. with a scope. Uh, and so, a custom skin as well. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Um, so you'll be able to customize your weapons, obviously, and uh, you know choose choose to fight Project at Eden's Gate in style, uh, whatever style fits you best. Okay. Nice, Alex. Yeah. Uh, but we see like some you know taller grass areas. And you yeah. can, this is also a spot where you can go and hide. Um, so you can really kind of uh, take some time to um, see the situation, kind of understand what's going on, um, and plan your approach a little bit more tactically. Yeah. Here, yeah. Alex is kind of just like gun, uh, guns blazing yeah. and going around. Uh, but yeah, that works too. 
And yeah, he has someone's been... asking actually in the chat if we can also customize the, the vehicles. Oh yeah, you're going to be oh, able yeah. to, to customize your vehicles, but also uh, your player avatar. Yeah. Um, so if you play co-op, you're going to be able to show off some cool skins that you might have. Um, but yeah, vehicles, weapons. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Take that. I have heated seats in my car, but that's probably way warmer than the heated seat. <laughs> yeah. Good job, Alex. And yeah, someone's saying uh, that the, the oh, hey, actually, our Reddit moderator, uh, is saying that the environment looks awesome. Um, we don't have the time right Ooh, now to look at the environment, that. but we have more time uh, later to, to drive around and see yeah. Oh, yeah. what it looks like. Uh, oh yeah, we can give you a tour mm. of, of Holland Valley and Hope County. Yeah. Uh, we'll yeah. go back in the plane maybe at some point and yeah. just like cruise around, look at the stuff. It, it's really impressive when you're flying around and looking you at the different... <laughs> nice. Throwing the knife. <laughs> it's okay, he, he, yeah, he yeah. got it back, he got it back. Woo. Good Thanks, job, man. Alex. Thanks. Okay, so I'll post. Liberated. Yeah. The push done. Tick. <laughs> Checked. No, but yeah. Oh, we, you're burning the. <laughs> they're burning the. There you go. The portraits. All the cold stuff gone. Yeah. Raising the flag. Mm -hmm. But yeah, so basically we just liberated that location from from the 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 project at Ian's Gate. Um, so we're gonna see a lot of different people coming in and kind of taking it back and preparing for fighting back against Project Eddie's Gate. The goal is really to build your own resistance however you want, uh, in which These order guys. you want. Yeah, those guys. See, those guys look like fellow, uh, fellow fighters. Oh. Uh, so you can speak to them, they might give you some intel. And you can uh, hire them? You can hire them. So Alex just recruited two new recruits, mm -hmm. um, wearing a badass Eagle t-shirt, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Oh. Uh, you can give them some orders, you can kind of direct them, uh, yeah. they'll really follow your play style as well. So if, if you're playing more in a stealthy approach, um, they'll try and take some cover, and once you open up fire, then they're really going to be there to help you out. Yeah, oh, and nice. I don't know if you just saw before, uh, Alex picked up the hunting review uh, yes. magazine. That, magazine? Yeah, that, that gives you a tip for hunting spots, right? Hunting spots, yeah. yeah. So there are really like a, lots of different items that give you some context and some information. Yeah. Well, yeah, the, the kind of the way now that the game will open up is really through uh, ex exploration and discovery. So yeah. we want players to just go around, um, you know, go in pretty much every house, kind of look under mm -hmm. every, every bed or every area to find those information. Because you might find, obviously, information about uh, hunting spots, fishing spots, but you also may find, I don't know, a new weapon, uh, a new tool to help you out in your quest, or just someone that needs help and that you mm -hmm. might recruit afterwards. Yeah. There is a cool question. I mean, interesting question from uh, from the chat. Uh, is there really no map? Ah, they mean a uh, mini map. Oh. Yeah, the mini. On I think the, they're the asking screen. about the on mini the map. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, this time around, we changed for a for a compass. Uh, so if you if at we go back to gameplay, screen. yeah, we'll see mm -hmm. at the top of the screen. It really shows like uh, all the coordinates. It will show you the quest markers and all the information that you need. Um, but we also have a world map. So if we, <laughs> oh, that's. <laughs> Okay. That's the what is we, need to, we need to talk about that weapon for a bit. Um, we talked about customizing your own stuff. Uh, Alex, can you bring out what? So, if we just stop for a moment and just enjoy the beauty of that paint job, uh, <laughs> it's like super retro. It's kind of an homage to uh, Rex Power Cult for me. It's blue, pink. Um, uh, anyway, it's just pure awesome, and it's got yeah. a silencer on it. Mm -hmm. uh, so. Check So yeah, no, keep keep talking probably. So yeah, we were talking about the uh, that, that that weapon that you just uh, picked, and there yeah. are also we melee weapons. I don't know if like yeah, yeah. You, you saw them at some point. There yeah. was a baseball bat. So we just um, have to do a, a quick uh, mic change, but uh, <laughs> Matthias can uh, keep talking about. What yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I was just saying the melee weapons. There was a um, there was a baseball bat on top of a crate, which yeah. you can also use either takedowns, melee fights, or just even like throwing it. Yeah. So, so where are we in... Ooh, what, what was that guy in the middle of the field? What, what, what is this thing in the, in the air? <laughs> They're shooting, but uh, an helicopter came out uh, of nowhere. Oh, <laughs> oh. oh. wow. Oh. Oh. What? Did you anticipate the helicopter Almost. was going to go? Almost. <laughs> yeah, maybe you need to go closer. If you uh, oh. oh yeah! Nice. Yes. I didn't think it would hit. I was like, it's gonna be <laughs> just missing. Close call. Oh, nice one. Oh yeah, we never know what the the, the cop is gonna throw at us. Like we yeah. saw a copter. There could be a plane. There could be a lot of different things. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah. And obviously some weapons are better than others. Oh yeah. For the helicopter, yeah, for the sure. rocket launcher was the best. And we're seeing, uh, you know, um, oh. Alex took it out with an RPG and his guns for hire actually uh, right now are equipped. Whoa. <laughs> nice. <laughs> the shovel, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. His guns for hire, I think, are assault based right now. Alex, I don't know. Uh, if I have know. a sniper rifle. A sniper. And, uh, so no. every guns for hire have a different kind of skill set or a different uh, tactical uh, use. Mm -hmm. uh, so you'll find maybe, or you, you'll be able to hire like assault rifles, mm -hmm. but also RPG. Okay. And another mic another check. Mic check. My other gun prior is dead. <laughs> he oh, got killed. Oh, that's why. Yeah, I was wondering. That's why he's not showing up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, okay. You lost a guy. That's good because there are only two seats in this uh, truck. Yeah. So. Exactly. So the guy, the gunfire is gonna, he gonna gun go in the, the truck yeah. with you. Yeah, he could have the, the second one could, could have. have gone in the in the yeah. back of the truck. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. I've seen that before. So, so I have a back, bit so. of a Thank driving you. to do. So I guess it's time for the raffle. Oh yes, absolutely. We did say that we would give away some uh, some merch at the beginning of the stream. Uh, so for those of you who follow and watch live stream uh, made by Ubisoft, uh, Ubisoft Montreal in particular, you know that we we organize these uh, these giveaways. So one way to do it, and again, it's for Twitch viewers. So Twitch in the chat, uh, you just need to type exclamation mark raffle uh, as soon as the uh, the raffle is going to be opened by our marvelous uh, moderation team. So I'm just going to keep looking at Gabe so that he can tell me, yeah, it's all good, it's open. Um, obviously, you only need to do it once. Yeah. You know, you no need to spam the chat with it. Doesn't help to do it to, <laughs> to, to type you, uh, it many times. Doesn't give you more chances. And it's yes. up. And it's Yay. open. Uh, and while, you know, we, we all enter the... Um, Maybe we the can show we some... We can uh, show the goodies. Yeah, we can show the goodies. Yeah. Uh, so what do we have? We have the, the hats that I oh, yeah. very conveniently placed on the... <laughs> on, <laughs> on, the my, on my head? You want oh, to wear it? Oh, so? yeah. It's, uh, it's actually a, it a, a cap that fits right, so that's Very nice. perfect. Beautiful. And it has so the uh, Nikrai company logo on yeah. it. Yeah, Nikrai exactly. Aviation. Yeah. Yeah. Why not? It's exactly the same cap as Nick. Um, almost the same. Almost the same as in the game? I think so. It's yeah, 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 yeah. Close enough. Yeah, yeah, it's really yeah, yeah, similar. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, then we have a mug. Yeah, the actually. mug. So this mug with the Far Cry 5 logo in front and the Hope County uh, image on the back. Oh, cows. That's nice. Yeah. <laughs> Get my mug way far. <laughs> and we have two pins. There you go. I don't think you can get them anywhere else but on community activities that we organize. Yeah, no, yeah. I don't think I don't so. Think. Think. Probably. We've given some of them at the uh, conventions. Yeah, so at, at some at Gamescom and yeah. E3. Uh, you can also also get the swags while uh, participating in the map jams. Yes. Um, so uh, map that leaders. Cool. Yeah. Then we have a yeah. t-shirt. So you've seen this one, I think, in our previous live stream. We're also giving one away. Proudly wearing it today. <laughs> yeah. 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 And then you have the hoodie. So it won't have the dev team uh, logo on top of it, obviously, because you know it's the, the, the player-friendly yeah, yeah. version. Uh, but you have a little image at the back. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah. A hoodie. That looks so nice. That's cool. And you have the Far Cry 5 logo yeah. on the top. So that's it. That's what we're giving away for this first raffle. Uh, so I guess. Maybe, have we picked the winner yet? Not now. No, yeah, not keep yet. Looking. Okay, so that's fine. In the meantime, yeah, we can let's keep, keep back. Uh, so we arrived at a, when, when did we arrive? It's the US uh, Auto Outpost. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So that's another location that's being taken over by, by the cult. Um, we see Alex, he's trying more of a stealthy approach right now, which is good. Um, <laughs> <laughs> which is, which is really good. Uh, no, but I like playing stealth. Honestly, mm -hmm. that's that's my favorite part because then you see kind of all the interactions of the yeah. of the AI of the NPCs. Uh, you get to really plan your attack. I prefer this kind of outpost. I prefer playing stealth because if you get undetected, you get extra bonuses, so you get like more money. Uh, so then, if you want to customize your weapons or anything, then it's easier for you. Um, there's also some some challenges in the game mm -hmm. that lets you unlock some perks. Okay. Um, uh, so we can maybe look at the perk menu right after. Yeah. Um, uh, but yeah, so the challenges uh, there's different categories, obviously, but like stealth kills, takedowns, mm. melee kills, explosives, uh, explosives yeah. all that sort of stuff. So depending uh, if you want to really try and complete all those challenges and kind of <gasps> get all of the perks, the available perks. Oh yeah, oh. the shovel. This is, I call it the happy shovel. Oh. <laughs> Obviously, like I mean, the only yeah. happy person right now is Alex. <laughs> I don't think this guy is really happy, but it's and the so resistance. nice. Mm. I mean, come on. Getting a kill with a smile. But what yeah. I think is interesting here it. is also yeah, yeah, let's uh, it. 
the 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 gun for hire uh, is also stealth. Yeah. So yes. he's following your your style. Oh yeah, right? your command. Yeah, exactly. Oh, nice kill. Nice. Uh oh. Oh. Got detected. Oh. Nice. So is he gonna? Oh, okay. Oh. I, I think the I think the off now. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're done. <laughs> So at this point, the, the, yeah, the guns for hire will start uh, kind of taking over. Mm -hmm. So Alex, uh, really tactically placed his guns for hire yeah. uh, on different vantage points, yeah, which you is see, you see yeah, you see the red, red dot. That yeah, was yeah. him. So okay. he's, he's trying to look for targets. Yeah. Um, Oops. Alarm is called. <laughs> okay, so whenever an alarm is called, that means reinforcements will be coming in. Like this big truck over there. Oh. Yeah, and then yeah. we see Alex smartly playing some proximity mines. Oh, oh, already. oh, that didn't go as planned. <laughs> I don't know who who <laughs> shot it or if there's, yeah. yeah. Oh, so we have uh, the... Oh, and we do have the winner for the... Yeah, for, for the, the raffle. raffle. Uh, he or she is called Digital Daigor. 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 Digital Daigor. Congratulations. Daigor. Yeah. Enjoy the swag. Yes. Hope you like it. We're going to send you a private message to check out the uh, postal address and send you out the package. All right, uh, we got a question from Protocol Rain asking if there will be night and day cycles in the game. Uh, yep, they are. Uh, so right now, I think it's it's almost the sun is almost setting. So we'll see we'll see a bit soon. Uh, you know, the nighttime, mm -hmm. which is really cool. Really cool. It really changes the approach. Uh, you're really a bit more stealth. Uh, the, you know, the NPCs will see you a bit less. Um, Looking if there's any other questions in there. Uh, would there be uh, night day cycles, maybe? Yeah, I just answered this oh, one. Sorry. What Did difficulty we... options are we going to have? Um, so Blake Duckers uh, <laughs> is asking, what difficulty options are we going to have? I love a challenge. Well, you're going to be served. Uh, I mean, there's a, a three, three or four, I can't remember, but I think at least three, uh, easy, medium, and hard. Easy, medium and and hard. hard is pretty damn hard. Um, and the cool thing is, uh, depending on, as, as you progress to the, through the game, uh, it's going to get harder and harder. Uh, meaning that the, the NPCs will go, are going to get you know, beefier, they're going to be tougher to, to kill. Um, and and you're also, there's going to be more of those like, heavy units kind of going your way. Um, in John Seed, John Seed has also recruited some special forces, which we call the Chosen. Mm -hmm. And those are the Chosen ones. And those ones are really made for a strong battle. And they might even chase you uh, through an airplane or an helicopter. So, yeah. So here we... So I think we, we liberated we the it. assets, right? So what we could yeah. do maybe yeah. now is just look at the challenges. Uh, let's take a look at the challenge list. So all those challenge is really meant for you. And we see the reward is actually uh, like the star logo. That's a perk point. So anytime you complete one of those challenges, you'll get one, two, or three perk points that you can then invest into a new perk. Uh, this game that we started, we mm -hmm. were actually we already were playing, so we already have a couple of perks yeah. equipped. Um, but there's a lot of challenges here that we we could try and complete. I don't know if the chat wants to suggest us any type of of uh, challenge Ooh, for that's Alex. A, that's a dangerous one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, why not? <laughs> there are some edge shots, uh, rocket launcher kills, flamethrower kills, arrow kills. So anyway, depending on your play style, you can really try um, you know, to complete those challenges and then invest in more perk points. We can also look at the perk. Uh, so what, perk would be, uh, what would be the option for the chats if, uh, if we can... Uh, yeah, I would say types. melee kills melee, is, yeah, is kill. a good one. Uh, arrow kills. A bit longer, maybe. Uh, uh, proximity mines? Uh, yeah, C4 kills. Yeah, C4 kills. Those are all super fun. Uh, takedowns, obviously. Um, standard takedowns, those are mm -hmm. fun. So yeah, let's suggest those. Takedowns, melee kills, and uh, uh, explosives. Explosives. OK, okay. Yeah. let's try that. <laughs> and then if we look at the perks, we we're going to uh, see this is the whole perks menu. So you can see that there's already some stuff that we have equipped, the yellow ones. Um, so Alex is just browsing now in the different available perks. Uh, you can really invest into your different play style, uh, invest in more health, uh, you know, uh, more takedowns. Um, this is human fish, so you can <laughs> swim faster and hold your breath. <laughs> nice, per nice choice. Obviously, a wingsuit and parachuting, which we used a bit earlier. Yeah. Um, so we'll see. Maybe later we can uh, find a different perk that we want to equip for ourselves and and cause some more uh, some more stuff. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, this is actually a, a quite interesting question. Uh, will the uh, AI reclaim outposts from time to time? Is it possible? There's actually a, a, a mode where you can reset the outposts in okay. the game. But AI will, will really just drive around. They will not try, if I remember, to reclaim the outposts automatically. But there will always be AI presence. Uh, so okay. you're, you need to always kind of be on your guard. There's going to be some convoys, uh, some different types of uh, you know, encounters that you're going to get. Uh, there's going to be some planes kind of flying around to kind of get you. So as you're, as you're progressing and as you're fighting against the cult, uh, they will really try and react and throw everything they got at you because they basically want to stop you. Yeah. You're, you're just a nuisance, you, you know? Nuisance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so they want to get rid of you but as like, soon as possible. One, once you liberated an outpost, basically it's just a resistance so took over and yeah. now is holding the outpost. Exactly, for you. Yep. Yeah. All right, okay. who's that guy? Okay, that's I, I Merle. Love their, I love their haircuts. The mullet. I, I love is a, their haircuts. Is a love, yeah, it's an amazing choice. Um, he looks straight, like, coming out of the 80s kind of thing, you know? Yeah. Should we, uh, should we take uh, the little uh, video break before, um, or just right after Mel give us the mission? After that. Right? Sure. Let's after listen to what he's got to say. Yeah. Yeah. Let's like that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh yeah, now we uh, we will be driving. Uh, we have uh, we have actually uh, while uh, while we'll be driving uh, to to the to the mission. Uh, very cool uh, video. You might recognize someone in there. Uh, an interview that was posted. In, uh... <laughs> no, <laughs> I don't see what we're talking about. Um, yeah, it's a, it's a video that was uh, either in UB blog recently, and it's a very funny one. So we wanted to to share it with you today too. Every time we get asked questions about the game, right, and, and we're asked, you know, what's your favorite part of the game or what's going to happen next as you're playing, the truth is, is we don't know because the game is organic. It pushes back on its own. I can't give you super hyper specifics on this, but what I'll tell you is, is that in previous Far Cry's, I think we had about 18 to 20 ish characters that you'd meet. Yep. And just on the premier side of things, we're over 65. And just in terms of the rest of the world, the world's incredibly deep, so I don't honestly know just how many characters there are, but everybody has a job, everybody has a purpose, everybody has an opinion, and everybody wants to contribute to you fighting back. I'm gonna keep on fighting, thanks. But what's really interesting is watching people play the game, and then after a little while they start to realize, wait a minute, I can mix up my squad. I can play with the guns for hire and the fangs for hire and the combinations, and they know each other. And some of the, uh, the banter between them is amazing. Just watch this hustle. Imagine all that, but with a buddy, like a yeah, co-op partner. Co so I just like just dropping in in the middle of nowhere and flying around while you're driving, because obviously you won't be flying, I'll be flying. Um, so I'm flying around, you're driving in your muscle car yeah. with your 70s soundtrack, and it's... 70s soundtrack, I mean, why is that a bad thing? That's an amazing... That's an amazing thing. My son can't appreciate <laughs> that here, but it's amazing. No, but it's great, it's great. And honestly, for me, one of the best feelings is literally to be up in the skies and just exploring and discovering Hope County. Like, obviously, wildlife plays always played a big part in, yeah. in a Far Cry game. Uh, the one little vicious animal that I hate to find, and especially hate to hear, is the wolverine. Yeah, the skunk's not fun, though, dude. What? The I skunks. Have you heard dangerous. the wolverine? I, I've, I've been, like... What does it sound like? Oh, this is gonna be good, wait for this. That's literally what the Wolverine sounds it's like. It's the gift that keeps on giving, you <laughs> understand? It's oh vicious, vicious is the oh, word. I can't. It's just, it's like Christmas every day when he does stuff like that. We wanted to put as much freedom as possible into the hands of the player. So just making sure that, you know, uh, you step in any situation and you're really free to approach it in, in a certain way. And play the game in a way we hadn't decided was the right way to play it. It's super cool to see. Right down! Just uh, joining right now, we are uh, live from Montreal Studio where uh, Far Cry 5 is developed. We are with Phil, associate producer. 
Matt, uh, lead community developer, Hi, and Alex, uh, dev tester. So we were on the way to a mission that Merle, 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 Merle just gave Merle. us, uh, driving around, huh. uh, meeting oh. some friendly Oof. faces. Nice. Oh my, Alex. <laughs> she needs and some help. And just saved a woman. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Great yeah, job. You, you'll, you'll find she looks as surprised as we are. <laughs> yeah, she was like, what? <laughs> what just like, happened? Nice shot. <laughs> That's good. Oh, and we see and still the are. guns for hire. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, is she, will she be oh, a nice oh, no, nice in the car. This guy. Oh, yeah, right. this guy. So we see the night, so the full moon. <laughs> Uber um, driver. Yeah. yeah. The guy sits in the back. He's <laughs> sitting on the back. Yeah. Like She's giving you the address. <laughs> Please go there. Back. She's a backseat driver, I'm sure. Who he, he is? He's, it's a guy. It's a, it's a guy. Yeah, okay, yeah. it's a he. It's a he. Nice. Uh, ah, you can see the stars. gas station? Yeah, that's a gas station. Okay. So oh. Merle, Merle, basically, for to give you context, Merle just asked uh, the player and Alex to find his, his lost uh, vehicle, yep. which was parked right there, but I guess the cultists uh, don't want to lose that vehicle, so they're yeah. just driving around. So Alex will need to jump, okay, yeah, in a pickup truck, why not? <laughs> uh, and try and chase it down. Right. So, That's why you have the uh, alert message on the top yeah, of the screen. Yeah, it's, because it's getting away, so Alex will okay. need to, to like, pedal to the metal. And going off-road. <laughs> Roads nice. are overrated anyway. Oh, there, you, there it is. All right, we'll see it jumping around. Yeah. That's nice. <laughs> um, so, will there be, I'm just going to answer a question from the chat. To, um, yeah. Will there be a cold? Uh, oh, we're losing. Okay. okay, yeah. Equi underscore two is asking, will there be a cold, snowy, or super mountainous area on the map? Um, actually, there's, there's three really distinct regions yeah. uh, in the game. Mm. Um, so there's uh, the Holland Valley, which we're playing in now. It's more of a farmland, uh, kind of plains, uh, you know, uh, yeah, industry, that type of stuff. Mm -hmm. um, and the two other regions, there's one that's really more into the Montana mountains, so really the, uh, the mountain ranges. So we can expect to see like different types of animals, yeah. different types of trees. It's a really different type of environment. Um, and there's also a, another more... <laughs> <laughs> What's happening? Great driving skills. Alex. <laughs> He's going to race. Just you. trying to ram it, I think. When are you ordering your autopilot uh, vehicle? Oh, yeah, you can do that. You can do that here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What? Where, where is... Okay, it's going to Jason, let me see if it's Where is it? It's right in front it's, of you. It's falling down. Yeah. Whee. You're falling down. It's okay. It's Good a four start. by four. Yeah. I think Alex actually got him. The guy. Yeah. Oh yeah. Nice. Good yeah. job. He got the guy. It's a cool car. It's parked in a weird place. Cool yeah. Car. It's amazing. Mm -hmm. It's amazing. Driving around that in you know Hope County, Montana, uh, definitely attracts some attention. I think. Oh yeah. <laughs> Ooh, and a uh, cougar. Yeah. Okay. Uh huh. <laughs> Suddenly, so we were talking about the wildlife. Uh, yeah. The wildlife so is kind of. Unpredictable, I would say, yeah. and sometimes mm -hmm. uh, ferocious, and sometimes it's really vicious. Uh, you know, there's a lot of things uh, happening in Montana. It's really a, a very um, kind of, I don't know, a, a great place for uh, for uh, fauna and flora, yeah. obviously, also. Yeah. Um, but we're gonna see some bears, some cows, some bulls, uh, some moose, too, yeah. some, some elks. Some turkeys. Some, uh, some very aggressive And very turkeys. fast turkeys. <laughs> like, seriously, you don't want to face a group of turkeys. Uh, they're pretty wild. They're really yeah. wild. I was like, uh, oh no, don't hurt the turkey. And then you start jumping. And I'm like, okay, I heard the turkey, I heard the turkey. <laughs> I think they're just like so mad about all of the years they spent Thanksgiving. You know, it's like, I'm gonna get a vengeance, you guys. I'm gonna get a vengeance. <laughs> Uh, but the more, I think the, the animal for me that's the most surprising is definitely the wolverine. Yes. The wolverine, and I did some research because um, it's, it's one of the, those little animals that you don't expect them to be it's that aggressive. aggressive. Yeah, yeah. They It are. looks cute. It looks like a, I don't Fluffy, know, a ferret, yeah. yeah, or anything, like something yeah. you'd want in your home. But yeah. if you get that in your home, you can't invite anybody. <laughs> yeah. Ah, Wolverine versus the hunted badger, that, that would be a tough, a really a tough, tough fight. Yeah. 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 Um, and we did, you did very thorough research that I did. we've seen from the... I did. <laughs> the uh, it's video. super carnivorous, <laughs> but actually it's, it's really because, I don't know, there's, uh, yes, there are some in, in Montana, but there's also some here in the eastern portion of, of North yeah. America. Yeah. Um, so at some point I went on a, on a trip what? and I heard a wolverine, and I was like, oh my god, what is this sound? And when I played the game, I'm like, 
oh wow, it's a Wolverine. It's the same. And since then, I'm super scared of Wolverines. It's so like what is, what is I, I don't mind sharks anymore. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's what <laughs> my nightmares are made of. It's okay. seriously, yeah, pretty bad. Yeah. Wow. Um, okay. Yes. Yeah. And, and because it's so small too, like it's really yeah, you can, it can hide like it easily. Oh yeah, yeah. It's so really you really surprising. need to listen yeah, yeah, instead of just watching. Yeah. Uh, is it first person only? So King Kama is asking if the game is first person only. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's first person only. The view. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, 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 yeah. the view. Yeah. Um, when you're gonna play co-op, mm -hmm. you're gonna be able to see your co-op partner and see like all of the cool gear or weapons or anything that he's. Uh, your friend, uh, you know, he or yep. she is going to have, mm -hmm. uh, but it's a first-person game. Yeah. Yeah. And same for your friend. I mean, he's yes. going to see your, your cool yeah. gear and, uh, and all Oh, that. yeah, definitely. Yeah, it's mm -hmm. good bragging rights, I guess. Yeah. You yeah. Know? I was like, uh, I, cool I found this in a cave here, or this guy gave <laughs> it to me. And you don't like, have yeah. it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh whoa. Okay. All right, oh, that happens. I guess, life. yeah. It's Maybe we work. can answer more questions well, from For everyone who was saying it is scripted, it is not. Yeah. And it's a work in progress build, so the game is yeah. coming out in in end of March, yep. March 27, uh, across all platforms: PC, PS4, yep. uh, Xbox, Xbox One, um, uh, not Xbox, Xbox One. Mm -hmm. uh, but yeah, all across all platforms. Your favorite yep. platform. So only two months left. Yeah. Waiting time. Yeah. And we have two console. We are we are prepared. And we're going to be back soon. Yes. So, so I'm just going to answer another question from, ah, the, from chat. the chat. Yeah. And keep them coming, by the way. Like Our moderation team is doing an awesome job. They're yeah. here to answer your questions and convey them to us. So keep it coming. Uh, we'll, so uh, we'll actually be able to see the map yeah. now. Yes. Yeah, we're actually going to so. gonna answer one of the okay. questions. Actually, yeah, from yeah. The chat. looking at the world map. Because, so uh, because we had to yeah. kind of reset yeah. uh, the game, um, mm -hmm. you, uh, so how it works now is if we go back to the map just quickly, you're going to see the fog of war. So everything seems hidden except for that one location called Falls End. Yeah. Uh, as you explore Hope County, uh, the fog is going to actually reveal more locations, mm. more, uh, you know, and if you meet some people and get some intel, you're going to be able to kind of learn uh, more of the quests or the treasures or the loots uh, that are available. So it's really about you need to explore and you'll need to find some stuff. Uh, but it's a full 3D map mm. this time around, so it's you can beautiful. really pan up, down, around, and look at different, uh, yeah, the different opportunities. So this mm -hmm. is the Hope, the Holland Valley region. Yeah. Uh, we're not going to show today the full map because I want to keep Aww. some secret. Uh, we can maybe <laughs> zoom out really quickly. <laughs> 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 did you see? Did you see? <laughs> but it's it's big. It's really yeah. big. It's you, yeah. you can really like spend a lot of time discovering. Mm. Um, so Alex is going to go to uh, Clutch Nixon. To Clutch okay. Nixon. Yeah, we're going to meet some. Some cool questions, and so we're flying mm. around. We're mm. back in daytime, and no more towers, like you said. It's unfogged oh, yeah. by your own actions, by your own exploration. Exactly. Yeah. So you're really discovering that world at your own pace. Yeah. You're not forced to do anything. Yeah. You're really like it's it's a free roam. It's uh, immersive. 360. Yeah. Mm. That's very cool, and a good way to see all that you know landscape uh, yeah. is to take the plane, like you said. Like you just look around, and you can see everything around you. That's really cool. So, are we? Uh oh, okay. are you gonna try Parachute? to land? Gonna land there. Oh, you're gonna, gonna land, land it. You're gonna try. Do you have your pilot On license now? Like? No. <laughs> <laughs> are we expected That's... to clap if you? Uh, no, make no, it? we're we gotta okay. be good. Uh, we're gonna be good. Uh, good. I think we're good. I think we're three. Good. Oh, <laughs> not bad. We are. A good. Bit, a little bit good bumpy, job. but yeah. it's kind of okay. Nick no, no, Wright would be proud of you. Oh, that's why you bumped, because this, this, this little rock on the way. Mina. Oh, yeah, but if I'm in good the Good job. Yeah. Well, it's very well. close to the border of the, of the road. Don't be picky. We, we no, landed. No, I know, I know, we I know. landed. Good job. Good job, Alex. I'm going to get rid of that. With bumper. a bow? Oh, nice. With, with an arrow. With yes. an explosive tip bow. Oh. Bow and arrow. So okay. uh, uh, you can uh, kind of... There's different modes of firing modes, yeah. different depending on your weapons. Okay. So the uh, the bow, you can really have just a standard uh, arrow, but there's also a flaming tip arrow. Oh, <laughs> nice. <laughs> Keep throwing stuff just, away. Like, just Why take not? it. <laughs> just drop it in there. Making it rain. Yeah, and That's, we can see that he's healing himself yeah, yeah, also. Yeah. 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 That the healing <laughs> the bandages. bandages. Oh, that's cool, because yeah. that was part of the challenge for the explosives. Yeah. So right. going back to the challenges the and perks. trying to learn, yeah, and get access to new perks. Mm -hmm. 
What is this? Okay, so Can this is basically... <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Alex. This is the guys Alex in not caring. <laughs> Someone in the chat was really impressed. How did the hell that work out? With the plane. Yeah. What? <laughs> um, so you have a little red yes, icon. So the red icon over the NPC's head yeah. is sometimes when they're going to uh, fall down, they'll go in a... In a Kind of down state, mm. uh, so they are available, and some some of the NPCs could revive them. Mm -hmm. um, so you really kind of need to stay on your guard because some enemies will not be, uh, you know, fully down until uh, you know maybe they're going to get revived. So you need to watch out carefully because they might come back. So okay. you can revive your gun for hire. Yeah, you can revive your guns for hire. You can revive your co-op partner. Yeah, and also depending on the guns for hire that you. Uh, hire with you and that you recruit, mm -hmm. uh, they might be able yeah, to also to revive, re revive you. Oh, yeah. right. So it works both ways. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Okay. That's another advantage of having a gun for hire with you. Ah, playing with a gun for hire or with a friend is yeah. probably the best way to play the game for me. It's mm. so interactive. There's always something. And there's even more surprises, which, which is for me, you know, all those what we call the Far Cry moments. Yeah. When you put another player or another... Uh, uh, Huh. Uh, Wait a minute. What's happening, Alex? You're using a perk now? Yeah. Nice. So okay. We'll be so perk. we've we've unlocked a perk which is called sabotage. Mm -hmm. So it really allows you to go and kind of sabotage or uh, put a truck in danger. And usually, <laughs> nice. That was a pig. That was a pig. <laughs> the back, yeah. This is like free bacon. <laughs> yeah. Like, oh, I smell it. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, that was good. Uh, but yeah, that perk is really useful because you can kind of set some traps for the NPCs. So if you yeah. see that an NPC might go to a vehicle, you uh, sabotage it, and then boom, <laughs> it's done. Yeah. So you have the fire propagation as well. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think yeah, we this complete is the, the mission, right? There we are. Ah, what yeah. is this? I don't think we completed, oh. the, unfortunately, the Merle quest. We didn't. Uh, it would have ended here. Mm -hmm. But now we see a nice little bronze plate of uh, kind of a, how do you call that? A um, handsome fellow? Memorial. Yes, definitely a <laughs> handsome fellow. He's very sexy with his mustache. <laughs> um, but no, it's Clutch Nixon. He's a, a stunt man. Yes, right? stunt, yeah, a, a stunt man that unfortunately died from uh, too many stunts, I would mm -hmm. say, uh, <laughs> in 1977. So if we, yeah, just read yeah. the plate. Oh, a nice so, eagle. Yes. Uh, one day is like the cinematic. Can you, can you play the whole campaign for up? Uh, yeah, so the whole campaign, yeah, G G G1 one is asking if we can play the whole campaign co-op. Uh, yeah, indeed, you can. Yeah. Um, there's only a portion of the tutorial that you'll need to play alone. Yeah. But after the, that, the game is fully open to play and with any friend that you have. Uh, so you'll need to invite a friend over uh, into your game, and then you can really experience uh, like kind of facing uh, Hope County and the project yeah. that Gate together. Nice. All right, so Clutch Nixon here. We got a quest called the Baptism of Fire. Uh, basically, Clutch, uh, he's a legend born in fire, yeah, and he's done that 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 kind of that race all, already. Yeah. So you kind of need to recreate that create yeah. that race mm. uh, in some uh, as an homage. As an homage. Yeah. An homage. Yeah. Exactly. An homage. He's a legend, that guy. All right, Alex, and, let's go. Yeah, in Hope Conference. Let's do this. I would like to see a cosplay of Clutch Nixon, actually. With okay. his mustache and like a <laughs> bandana, that would be amazing. <laughs> That's a challenge. I love because the, we already shared all oh, this. Nice. Yeah. They're coming from the we car already... on purpose, right? Yes. yes. Oh, yeah, yeah. And it's talking about stand. cosplay, you have some cosplay guys on the website. No, the plane. <laughs> the plane I created. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh. So, okay. <laughs> I'll make it. <laughs> oh, I'm not sure on this. I'll get that this was a bad idea. I, oh. I think we're stuck. <laughs> Ten Are seconds okay? left. Uh, I'm, I'm going to die. I'll burn <laughs> in that <laughs> car. And that's because you want to land the plane, yeah, the plane <laughs> on the ground. Land the plane very conveniently uh, on the way. That's not some good strategy there, Alex. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's the beauty of the game. We Again, never know unscripted. what's going to happen. Unscripted. Time's unscripted. Up. Time's up. <laughs> All right. Let's go move that plane a little bit. I would not have think that the plane would still be here. I mean, yeah, <laughs> but yeah. Yeah, yeah, of course. I forgot about the plane. Yeah. I think, yeah, yeah parachute. Like in the exact path. Like uh, the exact on path. the way. We could have just run through the. I mean, Try like, to jump over it, maybe. No, that would be a bit of a great stunt, yeah, by yeah, the yeah, way. Yeah. Yes. Jumping but on top of You don't of want the to plane scratch Camina. Through, through <laughs> uh, yeah. Through what is Nick Ryan going to say? So, uh, there is a, for those stunt people that yeah. like those types of stunts, uh, yes. there's actually a feature in, in the game, which mm. is a, uh, a flatbed truck. You yeah. know, when you're getting towed or yeah, whatever, yeah. if mm -hmm. your car is damaged. So you can really kind of bend 
the flatbed so that it's it creates a natural <laughs> jump ramp. So you'll be able to kind of create your own stunts by driving that flatbed truck anywhere you want <laughs> and just jump pretty over cool. over a bear would be pretty cool, I would say. Uh -huh. over, uh, a plane? over a plane would be also <laughs> amazing. All right, so I don't know if Alex is going to be able to kind of go around the plane. Oh, it's, it's oh, it down here. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. Because you resetted the mission. Yep. Nice. Oh, yeah. oh, I like those little ramps. Yeah, so you're going, you know, in a, like a dirt road. Um, and we see the sprinklers there, mm -hmm. kind of like helping uh, Alex not get on fire. No, it's the opposite, isn't it? I thought it's like no, because giving... Be, oh. No, because your car is on it's fire, on fire right. so you need the, yeah, the yeah. water to yes. pull you down. Exactly, exactly. Ah, it's like so a if you nice don't... race against time, yeah. kind of race against bomb time, kind of thing. Exactly, yeah, yeah. it's like self-sabotaging your car, basically. Yeah, <laughs> but it also means that if you if you uh, go off track, then you don't have the water, so you, so you also lose because, exactly. you're, because your car is on fire. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Clutch was a very, uh, like a showman, yeah. you know, yeah, he, definitely. he knew how to do a nice, <laughs> a nice spectacle, mm. nice, oh, yeah. big jump. Daredevil, that's All right, so I'm going to take looking a for. question from the chat as we, oh wait, we're just going to, oh, the finally, <laughs> boom. Oh yeah. yeah. Oh, and directly in the, in the spa. In the, in the, sp <laughs> <laughs> in the, in the lake. That was a nice jump. Good job, Alex. Yeah. Well done. Yay! Nice Thanks. driver. Uh, yeah, maybe some yeah, maybe there are some questions in the chat. chat. Uh, uh, so I'm going to take a question from Agliros. Mm -hmm. Is it true that you and your co-partner can be too far apart? Uh, for technical reasons, indeed, there's like a, what we call a leash. A so leash. there's a, a, a limit between uh, you mm -hmm. and your player, but it's fairly big, honestly. You mm. can be around flying a plane in two different directions, and uh, it's really it doesn't happen often that you kind of you know, get into that technical limit. Yeah. But indeed, yeah, there's, there's okay. some sort of a leash. Okay. Um, is the map, so I'm going to take another question from Hero Guy. Uh, is the map based on real world, re real world or made up? Um, mm. So we've basically, uh, obviously the game is set in Hope County, Montana. Mm. Uh, it's a fictional county in Montana. So we really recreated a whole brand new uh, county in Montana. Uh, we try to kind of represent what Montana is, uh, you know, from the vegetation, yeah. the biomes, uh, the types of animals that we have. Yeah. Uh, but all the locations that you're going to find is not something that you can find in real Montana, obviously. You had a team actually going in Montana oh, yeah. to, to do some uh, mm -hmm. and Yeah, like, take we went actually a couple of times and yeah. it's, it's a really beautiful state. Uh, seriously, I, we all fell in love the, the moment we stepped out of the plane. It was so gorgeous. It's everything feels open. Uh, it's super... Um, how can we say raw, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. and, and visceral still. Like it's really, it feels like Full nature is still kind of the in control. <laughs> yeah, in control and the most powerful thing. And that's what we wanted to recreate. Like there's, uh, you know, with all the animals and the forests and the vegetation, mm. uh, that's the feeling that we kind of wanted to get back from the game. Yeah. Because uh, that's what we felt when we went to the trip. Actually, mm -hmm. we're going hunting right now, no? Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. So I think we're gonna have that uh, Montana feel. Nice. Yeah. While hunting. Sure. That's cool. What weapon are you going to use for to hunt, Alex? Are you uh, uh, taking the bow? The bow. <laughs> yeah. Oh, the purest way of hunting. With explosive tips. Or? <laughs> oh, no, 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 <laughs> just you don't want to damage the skin. <laughs> yeah, because you can sell the skin after for, yeah, for yeah. money. So yeah. if you blow your animals up, I guess you can't sell the skins. Well, there's. I mean, the, there's yeah. two schools. I it's think. maybe less <laughs> valuable, let's mm -hmm. say, if yeah. it's all. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, nice. just shooting hey, some guys. Uh, excuse on me. The way. <laughs> <laughs> I think he was just asking for help, Alex. <laughs> Do you know where he's? Okay. So we just saw like a green exclamation mark. Ah, Those are basically treasure hunts. So mm. it's uh, you oh, know yeah, here. On yeah, the, across the, the world, you're mm. gonna stumble upon some locations or some areas that are hiding like better treasures, uh, and we really want the players to and to be enticed and go and and try and find some some cool loot or some some cool. I don't know, different uh, character customization stuff. Yeah. Oop, um, that's the way to do it. <laughs> what happened? It's like it a little was a yeah, the, okay. and, uh, okay. and two cultists <laughs> fighting against the... Uh, yeah. Stay away from Wolverines, Alex. <laughs> we never know what they're going to do. All right, so this is... Oh, this we should definitely try and, and get. This is a, a cult uh, convoy, mm. and it's carrying some explosives uh, from across the different region. Um, so there's a, oh, that's actually pretty cool. He's... Alex is trying my... to, yeah, yeah, he's, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's actually trying to kind of make it veer. Nice. Okay, so it's catching fire now. 
So we should, we should stay a bit at bay, you know, because it's yeah, an expert. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, because okay. it's metal, so it's oh. going to stop at some point. All right, I'll oh, try yeah. something else then. All right. Maybe we can... Dynamite. <laughs> oh, dynamite. <laughs> Yeah, because you can cook it as well. Yeah, you can yeah. cook it and you see... Oh, oh I think oh. you got the driver, actually. I killed the driver. Oh, no, oh, no he's getting oh, out. He's oh. <laughs> <laughs> I was Not like, he's getting he's pissed. He's getting out, but he's dead now. <laughs> like, what's happening to my truck? <laughs> he's going to need to call the, like, the, you know, the, the auto uh, insurance the company. Towing yeah, yeah. The towing truck? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> create a ramp. Well, the, who is shooting at my car? Nice. Okay, this guy so was just chilling. Civilians? Yeah, so we see we see some, some cultists trying to kind of get or get on board some civilians mm -hmm. um the the cult is actually you know they think that uh, the end of the world is coming so they're trying to save as many people as possible save uh, save yeah they think they're doing the right thing but obviously they're not um so as a player we just rescued uh, that civilian and oh. what's cool yeah they're picking up their weapons and they're actually fighting against like along alongside you against the cult uh nice. so alex just uh, liberated her and now she's she's on she's Alex's team. Yeah. what's her name uh, sorry Sally? Sally? Yeah. All right, Sally, the guns for hire. And she's Sweet. jumping on the, she's on the jumping. ATV. Yeah. It's really cool. Because oh. we lost the other guy, yeah? Right. Yeah, yeah the, the two other guys, because we yeah. changed, we changed yeah. games. Yeah. Oh, yeah, true. Forgot that. So now we're heading to hunt. I don't know if Sally is much of a good hunter, I guess. We're we'll find out. Yeah. Um, well, some some are, are worse than others at uh, hunting, so, or... No, I think they're pretty... Depends on the weapon, though. Yeah, they're just chilling around, usually, when you <laughs> hunt. I, I think they're, they're just casually not getting in the way, usually. Okay. So I'll try to They're craft looking the at you and judging you. Yeah. <laughs> Just Crafting no, what? That's not how I would have done it. craft hunting syringes. Oh. So I can see animals from afar. Yeah, so that's part of the crafting uh, loop. Mm. So Alex just crafted the hunting syringes. So we can kind of detect some animals uh, and some, some, some prey mm. uh, from afar. It doesn't seem like there's much here. Maybe if there we go be. further. We have to walk um, there's also different guns oh, for hire. There's one here. Oh, yeah. Uh, a like wolf? Bo Boomer, for example? Yeah. A wolf, yeah. Okay, I'll let Alex do that and I'll talk about Boomer right after. Yeah. It still has the explosive, the explosive yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, He's oh, fast. Yeah, oh, true he's of that. wolf is hunting a deer or something. So. Oh, wow. Oh, <laughs> it's you, a circle you're hunting of a life. hunter. <laughs> it's, it's a food great. pyramid. <laughs> oh, wow. Whoa, okay. That's, that's cool. Wow. Uh, so you can have both now. Yeah, get in. Oof. Oh, no, no. What was the end? Oh, yeah. a deer. A deer. Okay. Yeah. Just loot it. <laughs> deer skin. Yeah. We also saw a pop-up for a bait. Mm -hmm. So uh, again, like FC4, you can throw a bait, which is going to attract a predator animal yeah. uh, to really cause chaos Jeez. in an outpost or mission. Oh, yeah. Ooh, long, long, long distance shot. I love that yeah. track. Back to you. Uh, these are a question here uh, from. Uh, the actor Foshan, is it if we can disable the navigation arrows on the ground? Mm. Uh, and the floating and, and the markers, markers outside of the compass. Uh, that's actually a good question. I don't really have the answer. I don't know. I've never tested it myself, mm. uh, but maybe. Uh, I don't know. I'll, uh, we'll investigate and maybe yeah. we can go come back to you with the answer. Yeah. All right. And the next so, on stream. Someone is saying, okay, M. Sanad is saying, please tell Alex he's the best Gladue. Gladue, <laughs> nice, thanks. Alex, you're the best Gladue. Amazing. And this is definitely an homage to <laughs> Maxim Gladue, who sometimes, I guess, on some of the different events that we have. Yeah. Yeah, Alex. Alex is cool. It's a private developer joke. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, we have two. two for context, it. for everyone yeah, watching. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, someone is asking also, uh, is there a split screen in the game? And uh, no, no split screen. Uh, if you want to play co-op, uh, you can really play co-op, but it's, you're going to need an online uh, connection to play mm. co-op with a friend. Glutiny. Oh, quickly I read gluten, and I'm like, what? Oh, <laughs> gluten on a pig? Okay. <laughs> That's rude. <laughs> yeah, those right. messages have been written by the, by the yeah. cult. Yeah, the cult Basically will go the around. Sins. Yeah, mm. exactly. And the, they're going to actually tag some people with their own sins. Um, so when they tag those people, oh. it means that usually like they, they have committed a sin and they recruit them and try and repent them from their sins. Okay. All right, so Sally is back in the car. <laughs> and at least she's in the uh, passenger seat. Yeah. Not yeah. Like, a, like a Uber a driver. Uber, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. So and the blue arrows that we see on the ground, uh, oh yeah, like this. Yeah. This basically means that we've set a waypoint. 
somewhere. It's to help you. And it's really just to help you guide. Uh, you can also turn autopilot on, and it's just really going to follow the route. Mm -hmm. So right. you can focus on something else, either like, I don't know, checking your Facebook while you're driving. <laughs> uh, don't do that. <laughs> no. Or just watching the scenery. Yeah, yeah enjoy, the enjoying scenery. the view. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Or just having a casual Talking chat with, with your, Sally. Yeah. yeah. Uh, it's funny because like most of the guns for hire will have different banter and yeah. will say different things uh, while you're oh, nice. driving. So they might comment on what you see or a different location. Uh, <laughs> She's like, yeah, eating the dash. Sally is a bit of an impatient one. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, so all, even our specialist uh, guns for hire mm. will really have a lot of things to say and they can either, even talk between each yeah. other. So sometimes you'll see like, I don't know, I don't want to spoil anything, but there's, yeah, yeah, yeah. there's some specialists that really have, you know, uh, different Amazing. relationships. Oh, yeah. yeah. So anyway, it's, there's some interesting stuff in there. Okay. Yeah, I think we'll, we'll hear more soon about that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so we reached a... Um, whoa. Okay, yeah, there's some people that we need to deal What's with What's happening here? here? Oh, and that was a civilian car right yeah. behind it. Would there be a collectible to find, like, mm. like, like for? Is there a collectible to find? Uh, yes, there are collectibles in the game. Um, I don't think we've stumbled upon some right now. No. Uh, but there's definitely some collectibles, uh, which are tied also to the, to the story and the gameplay. Um, so it's, it's super fun to just explore and try mm. and find them. So yeah, in Far Cry 5, it's also all about immersion. Like yes. The, the world feels real. Yeah. Uh, you know, sometimes when you are inside the building, you see all the brand names and stuff. Yeah. That oh, make, yeah. It makes it feel real. It, it, it sounds like a detail, but the branding, uh, uh, adding some branding in the game, like fake brands like we mm. have here, uh, you yeah. know, fight yep. energy drink, uh, really help to kind of make the game feel more alive and yeah. more like a, a, almost like a real place. Mm -hmm. Like uh, Nick, Nick, Nick and no, yeah, uh, Ryan Sons, Sons uh, yeah. Aviation Company. All right, so we we are just in front of Zip's uh, Zip's house. Uh, so let's so go that, and meet him. That and dude, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> that dude. That dude. He looks friendly. Yeah. The shirt's yeah. open because you know the tip of the fame floor is so warm. <laughs> <laughs> I think there is also a, a fun fact about uh, Peggy's, right? What do you mean? Oh, Peggy's, yes. Yeah. Uh, Peggy's... Uh, Project uh, Eden's Gate. Exactly, so it's like a pseudonym almost yeah. mm -hmm. of Project Eden's Gate. So yeah. that's how like the, local, pe yeah, the yeah. local people of Hope County, Montana call them. Yeah. yeah. All right, so, okay, raising, the, raising stakes. the stakes. I don't know who, but I need to give a shout out to the person that <laughs> made all of those titles uh, for the missions. It's like all puns and like. Oh, oh, what did you Zip do? Really? Sally, come back. No. Oh, no, come back. <laughs> Zip is he's ruthless in a oh, car. Man. Oh, nice. <gasps> no. See? Oh. That's because of Sally. That, yeah, she's yeah. on the way. It's and, a revenge. Uh, because she would have saved you. I know. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's true. She can't come back anymore. Yeah. And Zip just like, I'm, he doesn't doing know where like I'm doing my own So long. <laughs> Sorry, we need to deal with stuff. Well, in the meantime, I just wanted to give a shout out to our awesome community because one of them, I think it's Tokyo Joe, yeah. brought or, you know, built this fantastic uh, plane. Uh, we were talking about Nick Rai. Uh, oh, and it's him. He's there. Yeah, it, it is, is inside. I don't know if you can zoom in on it, but there's the, the little Nick in it. Yeah, I'm, so I'm not going to move so in you can Kamina. zoom in. The yeah. name of the He's thing. like, hey. <laughs> people, anyway, I thought it was a, yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought it was a nice, uh, you know, nice shout out to, uh, yeah. you know, some awesome model makers, yeah. community members. Yeah, and we keep it in the here in the, in Spread Eagle. In the Spread Eagle bar. <laughs> in the Spread Eagle yeah. bar, where where the legends say that the community developers hang out after work. <laughs> <laughs> legends. <laughs> the urban legends. Yes. A myth. <laughs> Long time myth. All right, so we're back. So Sally's here. Sally, All right, Zip, come on. Move. <laughs> yeah, this oh, time. Don't repeat the same mistake. Oh no, oh no. Oh, it's okay, <laughs> we're good. All right. Whoa. Sally will probably join us after. Mm -hmm. um, okay, so we got a question from DC underscore ASCII 
asking uh, what about character customization. Uh, we're actually going to show it uh, soon. Mm -hmm. um, it's not available in the in the build that we have today. Uh, but you can imagine that pretty much all of the clothing that you have seen so far, it's something that you know players will yeah. be able to customize uh, and wear. So yeah. yeah, even that's gonna have its skin on the baseball. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, a, it's a it's a local uh, baseball team. Baseball, baseball team. team. Yeah. yeah. Hope County Cougars. Yeah, the Hope County Cougars. Cougars. Yeah. yeah. Uh, okay, we got another question from Moria. Uh, mm -hmm. The real question is, can you steal that flamethrower? <laughs> uh, you can get a flamethrower, oh, but... Sally's oh, Sally's coming Oh, Sally's coming back, yeah. You can definitely buy or find a flamethrower, but I, mm. I don't think Zip wants to get rid of his own flamethrower. Yeah, I don't think he would let go. I mean, you, you saw how he run over... He's got a personal connection over, uh, with it. Yeah. 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 He run over Sally, yeah, exactly. so, so imagine I would not try that. <laughs> All right, so we, we just reached um, the stockyards. Mm -hmm. And actually, so just to put the people in context of this mission, mm -hmm. it's um, the cult is trying some experiments on some animals. And Zip, being Zip, he's an animal lover. He loves those animals. He knows them all by name. Oh. Um, so he wants us to kind of put them out of their misery because it's really bad what they're doing to their animals. Mm. Uh, and they're not the same animals as they were. So Zip is like, okay, let's put them out of their misery um, and, and get, you know, kind of uh, uh, show those cultists that we're. Uh, you know, we're on it. Yeah. And that we care about that animals. That we definitely care. Yeah. All right, let's do it. Can you do such a long distance? Uh, Oof. Almost. Yeah. Nice. And he's falling. Like, <laughs> the slowest fall in the All right, so the animals are actually starting to fight oh. back. What? what? Okay. Those. Breaking the barriers. <laughs> what is this? What? So there's like animals on fire there running around. Go. There you Explosions. Go. <laughs> there's a bear rolling. Oh, that nice. Crazy. What was he doing? He was actually trying to, to kind of get rid the, of the yeah, fire. Yeah, of the fire. Yeah. yeah. Smart animals, man. Yeah. Yeah. yeah when we are on it. fire, we just like try to tap on our arms, but they actually roll on the floor. Way it's smarter. So chaotic. Yeah. This. Okay, but you don't even need to do just anything. To you just uh, enjoying yeah, the just, show. You, you just <laughs> watch them. <laughs> oh. Thanks, Sally. Oh, that's Sally. Oh, that's Sally. That's Sally. Nice. Yeah. Mm. Nice save, Sally. She has your mm -hmm. Okay, so now we need to get rid of those animals, though, because they're, yeah, they're not feeling well. I know yeah, how. They're in pain. That's yeah, I love the, how the yellow, uh, you know, icons just float around yeah, 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 yeah. thing, you know? And, and you don't know what's going to chase us, like. Yeah. Oh. Okay, Oof, the, the bear. bear? Oh. Whoa. oh, yeah, it's just what? destroying everything. <laughs> we might bite. Did you see the sign? No. <laughs> yeah. What did it say? It was we saying, might we might bite. Nice. Yeah. Okay, this is like this is like a tank. It's going uh, and yeah. ripping across all those fences. What? Yeah, and uh, and you can see use a medic a medic med kit, kit yeah. a med kit. Mm. Uh, but you have to to loot them, right? Yeah. You can't just uh, heal yourself uh, forever. Forever, no. yeah. you have to well, loot your med kit. Your your HP will progressively uh, fill back up, mm -hmm. but if you're really in danger, you want to use one yeah. of those med kits, yeah. obviously. So you have to remember to find to pick them up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, good job, Alex. So we got rid of the animal <laughs> and the cultists. So now, okay, yes, I'm looting. Uh, the, looting uh, some some of the, the lootables like this. Oh, there's an ammo crate here. Yeah. Will really help you to replenish all your ammo uh, or also uh, stock you up for any crafting that you might want to do mm. uh, in the future. Like uh, we saw Alex craft um, some, uh, some, some kind of syringe, yeah, to help you out. Uh, so there's going to be plenty of, of crafting, uh, all of the explosives as well. You can craft your own dynamite. Um, and there's also different recipes in the world that you can find to reduce the amount of, um, of ingredients that mm. you'll need to craft those elements. Mm. Ah, so yeah. you know the exact right amount of ingredients exactly. that you need, so you, it takes less, yeah. like it costs less. Oh, yeah, <laughs> I remember that. Oh, no. <laughs> what okay, is so, this? <laughs> The cultists are actually trying to bring some cows in for other future experience, experiments, but we've just set up a trap. Ooh. No! <laughs> cows crying. Oh, no Poor way. Cows. And Zip is so mad right now. Oh, there's one on fire. That's awesome. That's <laughs> awesome. It's just everything is blazing. Just for the information, uh, Gabe, uh, moderator, moderator, is just yeah. laughing yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so much right now. <laughs> Oh, this is like a barbecue. 
OK. Um, so I'm going to answer a question Dimitri. from the chat. Uh, Grenade Kev is asking, how do you expand your map? Is there towers you have to get like in Far Cry 3? Actually, that's a, one of the biggest changes we made in the game. Mm -hmm. There's all of that uh, kind of game structure is, is, is done. Yeah. Uh, we basically replaced it by just basically exploration. You're going to go around, explore the areas, discover some new locations, but also uh, find some magazines. Uh, talk to some people, and they're going to tell you about other different locations or quest givers. And it's really how you're going to explore this. Oh, nice. That was a nice takedown. Take uh, oh but yeah, gone are the towers. Uh, and in our uh, exploration, discovery, and getting to meet those local folks. Mm. So I That's good, uh, because it really encourages you to talk to, to a lot everyone. of people. Yeah, 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 and get to learn a bit more about their story and their yeah. fight and their struggle against Project Aline's Gate. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to take another question. Nicholas98 is asking if we're able to silence your guns. Uh, so yeah, part of the, the weapon customization, and we see Alex has a silenced weapon on hand now. Uh, if we could maybe find a shop too, we could show uh, a bit more of the, the weapon customization. But you can really add different types of attachments to your weapon. So uh, either silenced, uh, a silencer, a scope, uh, extended mags, all that sort of stuff is in. So depending on your play styles, and if you ever find that precious weapon that you like, you can customize it like however you like. So yeah. that's that's really fun. See, we actually see a bit of the map in uh, what you were talking about before. Like the region that we, yep. we unlock and see more. Um, so I was talking a bit about, uh, you know, the syringe earlier. I just wanted to, to come back to that because mm -hmm. Alex had a syringe which allowed him to kind of see yeah. uh, the, the animals on the hunting. Yes. Yeah. On the hunting. But uh, actually, Boomer, one yeah. of our specialist guns yes. for hire, he's got such a good sense of smell that when you're traveling with Boomer, he's going to detect those either enemies or animals from afar. So if you're walking around with Boomer, uh, you're going to see all those threats popping up. So he's really a good ally for this because he's constantly warning the player and warning you yeah. of a, an impending yeah. threat, you know? Tagging them. Maybe. Yeah, tagging them, exactly. Mm -hmm. And the so kills just won't useful. react to him because he, they don't know he's a threat. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, he's Roaming just, dog. He's the best exactly. spy. He's such a good spy. <laughs> and everybody so loves nobody, dogs. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Nobody, everybody nobody wants attention. a pet. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's pretty cool. Oh, car chase. Car chase. Yeah, and we can hear the music on the way. Ooh, that running. I think the driver is still alive. Yeah? I don't back. Uh, no. no. Where's <laughs> Sally? <laughs> Just in case. I left her at the other place. Another okay, car. so Z Sally is with, uh, with Zip? Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's going to be for an awkward conversation. <laughs> <laughs> so remember you when you run me over? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Oh, yeah, no. No, it doesn't Are you sure it was you? <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, and we can see the, the big yes on the mountain. Yeah. The motto of the, of the cult. Exactly. Power it's a, of the yes. Yeah, it's actually the motto of John C, too. He's really into... Oh, what was that? Oh, that's okay. The that's, chase. Yeah, it's a chase. Yeah. Okay, so we're driving back to Falls End, uh, mm -hmm. which is one of the communities in the game. Yeah. Um, so in the game, there's going to be uh, the three different regions, but all, there's also some communities to discover. And communities are like major points of interest where there's going to be a lot of things that you can do. You can uh, buy some stuff, you can uh, meet some new quest givers, yeah. uh, there's also some good loot. Um, so we're going to see some here mailboxes. some mailboxes. <laughs> okay, so one fun thing about mailboxes is uh, you Ooh, can actually, yeah, you can actually, uh, uh, let's yeah, say I'm, I'm playing with you yeah, and you're my co-op partner and we're driving around. Yeah. I can be like <laughs> leaning out of the passenger seat and just swinging at all those mailboxes <laughs> with a like the happy shovel that we saw earlier, yeah, yeah, or the yeah. baseball bat, or anything else. Uh, it really makes it super fun. It's yeah. not it's not part of the game mode yeah, or whatever, yeah, yeah, yeah. but it's just like just for pure fun. An option. So see, we have the whack, um, uh, like paddle, I guess. Mm -hmm. um, can you customize your bow? Also? Yeah, you can customize your bow. Let's customize the bow right after. Mm. So different skins, different attachments, uh, silenced, yeah. uh, you know, scopes, extended mags. So really, you can. Pimp your own your own gun, really? basically. Uh, but yeah, all the categories are there: sidearms, the shotguns, the assault rifles, uh, sniper rifles, and then some more special exotic mm. weapons like the bow, the flamethrower with the flame. Oh yes. That's a nice. We one. even saw a fishing rod. Uh, <laughs> I mean, it's customize it. Yeah, you can customize it definitely. You can. Everything. Ah yeah, there's some really cool ones. 
Uh, the artist that, yeah, the artist <laughs> that did the weapons did a really amazing job. Yeah, the paddle uh, with the whack. Whack. That's exactly, you know, it's like that old school Batman yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, TV show. Like, bang. bang. Yeah, exactly. It's cool. <laughs> We're going to have a, a sneak peek at the spread eagle bar and have some like a barception. <laughs> Whoa. This is where we are. <laughs> That's so weird. <laughs> I don't know what But they have chips happening. in there and we don't. Like, no. I'm feeling hungry right now. <laughs> I want to eat some chips. But wait, we. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Some poutine, maybe. Oh. No. Yes. Only at lunchtime. <laughs> yeah. Right before the stream. Um, there's also, Navigate. like, you can. Uh, yeah, here we're, we're seeing the church. So this, is, this was part of the E3 demo. Yeah. Um, this is where Pastor Jerome is staying. This is where also Mary May is staying. Mm. Um, you can hop on the quad, like meet Pastor Jerome and all, all those other characters. Um, yeah, so it's all part mm. of the, you know, the story of how they're fighting against Project Aliens Gate. You're basically coming into this county as a bit of a, you know, you're one of the new recruits of the sheriff. Um, and you're coming in this county to arrest the father. That's the first thing that your first mandate as a uh, recruit is yeah. this. Uh, but something goes wrong, and you're kind of put into the midst of this fight against the locals and also the Project Eddie's Gate. And it's really how you're going to, like, who you're going to recruit, how you're going to save them, um, and how you're going to fight against uh, the Project at Eden's Gate. So it's uh, daylight again, sun rising. So uh, oh, yes, it looks gorgeous. Beautiful. Beautiful the golden, colors. Golden hour. Yeah. yeah, you can really feel the colors. Is that a? Oh yeah, that's a tractor with a mulcher in front of it. Okay, oh. so this this is like. <laughs> I wonder what you can do with this. This is like a T Rex on wheels with its no. big jaw. No, oh, no. God. oh God. Alex, why? <laughs> but okay, let's use that against Project Adin's Gate. Yes. Please, cultists, let's do that. Let's find some cultists and mulch them. Oh, I think there's a truck coming. Enemy? Yes. Yeah. Oh, it's a big oh, truck. Maybe it's a, a big too big. An explosive one. Yeah. Would not be such a good idea. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it was with the knife. Um, so I, I'm going to uh, answer a question from Forbidden Tech. Yes. Uh, how much does the game follow its predecessors with pulling, putting stealth option at the heart of the gameplay choices? Um, yeah, like all the previous Far Cry's, it's really up to you to kind of define how you're going to play this game. Uh, you could play full assault rifle, full like long range if you oh, prefer, you. or full stealth. Um, and what's fun is all the guns for hire are really going to adapt. Uh oh, are really going to adapt um, to to your play style. And th for this time around, we really wanted everything to kind of feel like a weapon or a toy. Uh, so we see now vehicles like that tractor feels really like a weapon or a toy. Um, there's another mission which we call the, the Widowmaker. And the Widowmaker is actually like a big semi-truck oh, that yeah. you can use almost like a, a, a battering, battering ram, you yeah. know, like d uh, destroying stuff. Roadblocks. And, yeah, and yeah. It's even equipped with machine guns on it. So, I mean, this is pretty cool. <laughs> uh, you can actually, for the first time, <gasps> get it. Oh, yeah. no. You will get in a, yeah. You can get in a chopper, uh, yeah. and you can also grapple onto a chopper. Yeah, that's really cool. It's like a really big mm -hmm. swing. Like in co-op? Like bungee. Yeah, in co-op. Well, even in single player, if your guns for hire is flying the, co uh, the chopper, yeah, yeah, yeah. you can like uh, yeah. grapple, grapple hook. Yeah, That's just like cool. Tarzan. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, so good. everything is almost a weapon, and you can really customize your own experience based on how you want to play. Nice. Um, yeah. Yeah, I think we did all the questions. Mm -hmm. So where? We're just waiting for the game to la to charge. Yeah, yeah. Because Alex died. <laughs> Sorry yeah. about that. <laughs> it's okay. Good job. It's funny because you were bragging before the stream. Yeah, no, you're saying, no, I'm never dying. It's going to be die. fine, guys. It's just a. Ah, and you're still in the tractor. Oh, and I remember this um, yeah. treasure hunt. Yeah, well, it's not a treasure hunt. Oh. This is more of a. But it, it's all also a really nice puzzle. Yeah. Um, so you see, like, we had to shoot the, the ladder. Yeah, and then it opens up, and then we can. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's a beehive. Oh, yes. oh those little, yeah. What so those are really sneaky because oh. mm -hmm. you don't you don't necessarily see them, yeah. but you hear them. You hear the buzz, uh -huh. and it's really vicious. It's really mm. it always takes you. So now you have to run. It's like the Wolverine. I think it's okay. Yeah, oh, yeah. You don't necessarily see when it. When you destroy the nest with fire, <laughs> you're good though. So. Stop scaring me, Matthias. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I Ooh. love this. Like Crazy. Yeah. telling a story and yeah. your little yeah. notes. 
that's a kind of place where money. I would go to retire. Yeah. I mean, that's uh, pretty cool. Fishing, well, uh, well, as a kid, you know, hunting. just. <laughs> like a survival. Oh, how do you access? Ah, uh, you need to climb that. So you, you really need to do, like, to pay attention to your surroundings and yeah. all the little, yeah. Audio or That's cool. So looting. aids. Very cool. Um, someone is ask. Someone is asking. Uh, it's Roy, four one one four. Is asking if you shoot one of the villagers, is the entire village comes after you and tries to kill you like in Far Cry 2? <laughs> they're friendly and forgivers. Uh, actually, um, obviously you don't want to mess too much with the resistance because yeah. they're well equipped usually. Mm -hmm. uh, so if you shoot one, they might kind of forgive you, but then as you do it more, uh, they'll really erupt and you kind of need to go away for a few yeah, minutes, kind of mm. let them cool down, and then you can come back and it's okay. okay. Yeah, yeah, because just before uh, the live stream, we, uh, we went uh, just hunting to, to rehearse, and uh, I don't know, Alex has a good idea to, <laughs> to shoot the lady <laughs> there, oh. and she had a dog, and then the dog attacked us. What? Yeah. Uh, so like, don't mess with my yeah, human. No. <laughs> So, the so they can definitely retaliate if, uh, oh, if, yeah, they're, yeah. If, if they're unhappy with you. Oh, we have this so that's, a run. that's a nice uh, little open uh, engagement. And you just gave Sally an order, an, an order. to yeah. shoot at the enemy. Oof. Oh, smoke, smoke grenade. Bomb. Nice. Oh, the whack. <laughs> nice. <laughs> so he was a VIP, so just a bit harder yeah. to kill. Uh, so we get more uh, resistance points, like mm -hmm. we saw. Um, as you progress through the game and you either complete some missions, save some civilians, or kill some VIPs, your resistance gauge is going to like fill up, and that's going to be the moment where you're kind of uh, John Seed is going to, uh, you know, retaliate and the cult yeah. is going to start fighting back. Okay. I love seeing that whack. <laughs> <laughs>